I went to see the Avengers with my nephew, who's 10. And, uh, and he loves all the superheroes. And I remember thinking uh, when we first, we went to see Spider-Man, you know, uh, Batman, uh, even the Star Wars movies, which are not superheroes per se, but there's an element of that. And it's something that as a kid, and I actually, I did read the comic books when I was a kid, uh, Superman and, and Batman and the Green Lantern and Wonder Woman and, and there's something just es purely escapist about it which is nice when you're miserable as a kid and everybody else has control and you have no control it's great to I think that's the thing you project yourself into these people and you have you can be the Hulk and you can be stronger than everybody else or you can be the Flash and be faster than everybody else and so I think there's an element of role playing that that you enjoy as a kid and I don't think you ever lose that the need for superheroes I mean every culture has its you know it's sort of mythical heroes we have to have uh, heroes that come out of the the period that they were created in the culture of the time and when you look at you know Stan Lee the universe that he created it really is and he has a cameo in the movie which is funny but it really is as much about um, again our fears of the things that we create which we lose control of you know experimenting with drugs what if it turns you into somebody that you can't control your rage or um, or you wish that or you like to think that there is that there are people out there, there are other, like Thor. <laughs> Thor is out there somewhere with his blonde hair, but Thor is out there and uh, there are other life, life forms that want, us, that, that want to look to us as allies and not always want to destroy us because one of the issues for me always, and I raise this question frequently in classes I teach, why is the future always dystopian? Why isn't it utopian and why, does, why is it that the aliens always want to kill us and eat us or control us, which is what Loki, the character in the Avengers, wants to rule the Earth, you know, puny Earth people. And there's a great line in the movie, which I won't give away, but somebody reverses that line on him. So it's just, I think that's the, that's always going to be the appeal of superheroes. And it will never get old for people um, because you're always going to have the next generation of kids who are going to have those same feelings. And when you become an adult, you can either look at it nostalgically or you can say, um, yeah, you know, it's that moment of escapism again. And I think we all like to think <laughs> that we have some sort of, you know, uh, superpower, whatever it is.